What's up YouTube? Dougie Chong here. Welcome to today's YouTube video where I'll be reviewing the brand new Well Simple Trade app. I also got a new camera so leave a like if you can notice a difference in the quality. I'm really excited about the Well Simple Trade app because it is the first zero dollar commission trading platform here in Canada. In the United States they've had apps such as Robinhood and Webull for a long time now. And those apps, Robinhood and Webull, put pressure on the big banks such as TD Ameritrade and Charles Schwab to offer zero dollar commissions in the US. I'm hoping that can happen here in Canada as well. In the past, commission fees were as high as $50 to trade over the phone and this made sense because you needed a broker to put the trade in for you. But in today's digital age, it simply does not make sense to charge customers such outrageous commission fees. This is great if you have a small account because if you're only trading a few hundred dollars, that commission really eats into your profits. So now we'll go into some of the other pros of the Wealth Simple Trade app. The first positive is that the Wealth Simple Trade app is available on mobile devices. Both iOS and Android can download the Wealth Simple Trade app. The company really put a lot of effort into making a nice clean user experience and user interface. I'll see if I can show some screenshot here. It's very simple to use. There's a buy button and a sell button where it's pretty straightforward to buy and sell stocks. Another positive of this account is that you can hold both RRSP and TFSAs in the Wellsimple Trade account. A lot of people do not know that you can hold stocks in a TFSA and RRSP but you are allowed to do so and it is a lot better than holding it in a simple savings account. A third positive of this account is that there is absolutely no minimum deposits. You can get started with as little as five or ten dollars even. This is different from the big banks which typically have minimums around five to ten thousand dollars. A fourth positive of this account is that it is very easy to set up. The total time takes about five minutes and the only pieces of information you need are a SIM card and some other basic information. It's important to note that you will need to link it to a bank account. Most of the big banks in Canada here are supported such as TD, CIBC, and Tangerine. Now let's move on to the negatives of this account. While it has a lot of positives, nothing is without its flaws. The first negative about this account is that it is a mobile experience only. I'm hoping that they will make a website shortly for this since both the Wealthsimple Cash account and the Wealthsimple Invest account are available online. I personally like to do a lot of my investing on web, on the comfort of a laptop, and not on a mobile device. So I'm hoping that they make a web platform soon. Another negative of this account is that it doesn't have a lot of fancy tables that show you your gains per stock and it doesn't have a lot of advanced features such as market research and goal setting that other big bank brokerages such as TD might have. So if you're just doing simple buys and sells, this is a great app for you. But if you rely on a lot of extra features, maybe a big bank brokerage is good for you. Another risk with this account is that they are a fairly new company. I think they were established in 2014, so that's about six years now. On the positive side, they are CIPF insured. This insures your account up to $1 million if Wealthsimple were to go bankrupt. Another key negative of this account that really got me was that there's no day trading allowed. And while most day traders use other brokerages for their sophisticated charting technologies, I personally wanted to use it just for the no commission trades to do quick trades within the day. They don't really define exactly what the limits are for day trading, but they expect maybe one or two trades per week. A fifth negative is that it is not connected to your Wealthsimple Cash or your Wealthsimple Invest accounts. This means that you have to put the exact same information twice. Even though this process only takes about five minutes, it is rather annoying and I hope they link the accounts in the future. A sixth negative is that the Wealthsimple Trade account does not show all the stocks on the US and Canadian stock market exchange. The rationale is that they want to protect investors from risky companies and the potential to lose a lot of money. 
I believe that they should allow customers to buy whatever stocks they want. Even if it is a risky company, they should not censor certain ones. A final negative is that you cannot open a US dollar account. This means that if you want to buy US stocks, you have to buy them in Canadian dollars and then they charge I think a 2% fee to convert your money to US to buy that stock. And then they charge you another 2% on the way back. This is how they are able to make money since they do not charge commission. In summary, the Wealth Simple Trade app is a great new app for new investors with small amounts of money. It has a clean, easy to use user interface and it's the first $0 commission trading platform here in Canada. I'll leave a link in the description below to the Wealth Simple Trade app. If you use my link, both you and I will get $5 off our next trade. That's it for this video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you learned a lot about the Wealth Simple Trade app. Let me know in the comments below if you're thinking of getting it, or let me know what brokerage you guys use. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you have not already. Thanks a lot for watching.